knelt as boys. Rise now as men of the Night's Watch. I like that line, that's cool. I'm pretty sure they say that a few times in the show Welcome as well. Welcome to your new family, Garrett. Why spe oh, I was gonna say, why specifically me? <laughs> Cut it off! Cut it off! Oh. They say, don't leave a bro hanging! Yay, everyone's friends. That's it? I thought there was more. Oh, uh, you know, I bet the other people didn't really care for the, the old gods. Now. Means we get to piss off the wall whenever we want. Didn't know you needed an excuse to play with yourself, Finn. Garrett, oh, that. you've got a visitor. The, the best Over friends there. that anybody's at. Oh, oh, oh. Who is it? Do I look like your fucking squire? It's Asher for some reason. <laughs> Who can it be? Is it someone gonna be like. I don't know who that is. Is it someone from freaking um, Iron Wrath that's gonna John be like? Snow's right about Mantrader. We're going to need all the weapons we can make. <laughs> Boxman's is like, why are you talking to me? God, is this gonna be like someone from like one of the bad soldiers at Iron Wrath, one of Ramsey's men, be like, I'm don't gonna kill everybody. Short. Oh, Uncle never mind. Duncan. It's Uncle Duncan. Got it. Dunkin' Donuts. It's good to see you. So my they Uncle told Duncan. Me you were at the weir <coughs> Wasn't sure you'd be back in time. Ah, I missed, missed your you. Uncle. I never expected to see you here. I'm not long the chip is. The Night's Watch. A delivery of ironwood shields to keep you all out of harm's way. That settles it then? Right, the delivery looks in order. I hope so. Sheesh kaboogers. Oh, the gods do grant miracles. You look well, nephew. No, oh, some I'm miracles. I told you a ranger now. That's good. A powerful Uncle? ranger, even. Things aren't going well at Ironrath, Garrett. I know. I always forget the name of the soldiers that I are there. I heard the news about Ethan. Oh, yeah, Ethan dying. I was standing not five feet from him when Ramsey struck. It's a nightmare that plagues my dreams. Freaking Ramsey, house man. Forester is nothing if not resilient. Our house I survived for centuries. Let's find out how we can help. Uncle. Let's go tell me something about the, the North Groove. enemies are circling Ironrath. That's why I'm really here. Do you recall Lord Forrester's last words to you? I, the late Lord Forrester, you mean? You have to be quiet. Just before he died. No. Gregor's final command. I don't remember. <laughs> confidence. He said the North Grove must never be lost. Indeed. But first, it must be found. So it's us. I've been reading his journals. <laughs> Scouring the legends for any clue what Lord Forrester knew. I think I found the answer. It's beyond the wall. Shocked. He describes a fortification, a protected citadel of sorts, hidden from the world, one filled with great power. It was scattered among his notes. Almost an obsession. A vital secret he Bro, I don't know how that's gonna help costs. us. There's a freaking magic ghost in there. Wall. His notes suggest as much. That no and one can fight but me. It, the search the won't sword be of Gondor. But you're a tuttle. Our lord knew you wouldn't fail him. Somewhere north of the wall. That's not a lot to go on, uncle. How am I supposed to find it? Yeah. Beyond the wall is a huge the first place. chance you get to head north. Take it. And then? Get separated. The watch behind. And strike out on your own. This is no small request I make. I know that. I'll do, I mean, I agree, Uncle. But how? A brave answer, Garrett. I will do it. This is the whole purpose I'm here, to be honest. This will help guide you. So I'll do it. I found it hidden. Save my in family. Lord Forrester's strong box. I mean, to be honest, it would not be that difficult. Like, how did? What is that? I don't feel like it would be that difficult Page to get separate from, our from everybody. Journal. But when he tore out and kept separate. Why? Like if I they get attacked know. by like wildlings or something, just slip away and then get to say the you North got separated. Crew. You got chased Aye. by some wildlings. Oh man, I was not listening to that. What's this? It's a, a mammoth. <laughs> this map's only missing grumpkins and snarks. This can't be real, Uncle. Oh, it probably can be. Probably giant freaking mammoths walking around. You said it was a citadel of some kind. Could this be it? It's probably. No, no it couldn't be um, that easy. It's hidden here somewhere. Probably the the guy that has like a whole bunch of wives that are all his daughters, and it's weird. I used to be frightened of where we trace. The wildwood whisper. 
I swear. Oh, I wonder if that's a hint, actually. I could hear him whispering sometimes. Well, listen. Listen, it says something. Hear the werewolves whisper. Yeah, that's important. This looks familiar. What is oh. it, Oh. Talia gave me this. <gasps> it's a key! <sighs> it's definitely a key. Wait. Lord Forrester gave Ethan a similar one as well. We're gonna find a place Lord where I have to put that. Don't lose it! Wonder. Why'd you rip it off the string, asshole? Look. Do we gotta, like, put it down? There's a clasp. It must open. Are you serious? Is this not something you probably should have... Aw, oh, I can't... The North Groove beneath the watchful eye of the dragon. I feel... Come on, seriously, no one no knows this first. This was inside. What is it? Another werewolf. But why? Maybe it's a key. To solve in the map. Probably. Let's put it down. Somewhere. I don't know where, but... Here, Let's see what happens when I rotate it. Hey! Perfect fit. Maybe no it's telling way. us where to look on the map. Um. Sure. I mean, I don't really know. Let's, let's pick it up. I don't think. I don't think that's too close. If anything, it's gonna be like the farthest place possible. Uh, actually, I feel like it would fit best here. Rotate it. Oh, you know what? With these mountains, it's gonna. There we go. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, it's the whole map that has to turn. Aye. This is cool. I don't know what I'm looking at. Its mouth, Uncle. Whatever this place is, the North Grove must be near. There's only one way to find out. Here. Take That's this cool. Map. Everything we hold. That's dear, really. Cool. I like that a lot. On That's success. really clever on Telltale's it's part. To put on your shoulders. The lives of a whole house. I won't fail. Tell everyone back at Ironrath that Garrett Tuttle has taken up the cause. Your Yay. sense of honor is a quality I've long admired, Garrett. What do I feel like I'm gonna be like caught? I feel like someone's been listening God in this whole time. Over you. You're the son I never had. I'm gonna end Let's up with go, like Finn Gary. and um Cotter. The three of us are gonna, they're gonna end up with me, I bet. Bye. Not even a bye. Probably like little, little shards or something. Oops, I never so left one of those like again. A weapon. <laughs> well, your piss is like any other liquid, I reckon. Yeah, Mine's else? mostly ale. Mine too. I'm an alcoholic. Break up into little them. icy bits. Yeah, Carter is his name. Okay. Fast. What do you guys want, asshole? Serious? A stranger arrives and you're chatting him up. It's my uncle, Someone asshole. Said it was your uncle looking for you. Well, what did he want? Looked like you two had a lot to talk about. Is Castellan to House Forester? Yeah. They sell ironwood to the builders. So you were just talking about love. He's my uncle. Jeez. It looked like he gave you something. A it brand new puppy. Let's go and celebrate. Wow, that wasn't Already suspicious at all. Keeping secrets from that. your brothers, eh? That wasn't suspicious at all. Right. The wall's gonna melt before we get up there. Come on. Thank you, Carter. <laughs> you probably should not have said that, to be honest. Because I mean, come on, <laughs> they could go up and talk about this at the same time. It's not like we're gonna forget. I mean, this is a long ride up too. I'm pretty sure it's like five, ten minutes to go up this giant wall. So. <laughs> Man, that must be fun to like pull ropes and all that to make this go up. I don't remember how actually the elevator goes up. Pretty sure someone spins a wheel or some crap, but still, I feel like that'd be really heavy to do. Oh boy. Are we ever gonna load here? Did the game crash? Oh, no, it did not. Yay! We're gonna be in um, King's Landing now. Ah, oh, called it! There are so many guests already arriving. And have you seen the wedding decorations they put up in the gardens? Oh, yeah, my so friends. Yeah, yeah, that's beautiful. I killed a man you last know, night. <laughs> we're as lucky as she is. Marjorie was but a lady when we were sent to serve at Highgarden. But in just a few days' time, we'll be attending to a queen at a royal feast. It pays to be a queen's Where friend. Standing, we'll be able to see everyone. And everyone will be able to see us. Mm. Ah! Damn it. Oh, I didn't do it in time. Crap. I've been meaning to say... Oh, well. What I told you about my 
family. I don't even remember what you said I about your family. I hope I mistake in trusting you. <laughs> yeah, totally. I mean, can't break trust when you don't remember. Yeah. If handmaidens don't help each other in King's Landing, nobody will. Thank you, Mira. And you know I'll always help you. Too. Oh, you better. I'm totally not going to take advantage of that. There he is. Lord Morgren? No, no, next to him. Lord Tarwick. Ugh. Really? I don't want to be a handmaiden forever. And this wedding may be the best chance of meeting a husband I'll ever have. That's I have gross. to go talk to him. <laughs> He's like Marjorie 50. Marjorie won't notice for a few minutes longer. Could you make an excuse for me? Yeah, why not? Please. Are you sure you know what you're doing, Sarah? Marjorie's so busy. I can't just wait for her to yeah, find a match for me. I don't see the issue Please, in that. Just don't tell Marjorie. Whatever. Well, I never specifically agreed to it, so. Cowboy! It's the Doughboy! Two Doughboys in this. I don't know, there's Dunkin' Donuts and there's Doughboy. Yeah, why not? Oh, that doesn't look suspicious what are you at doing all. Here? Oh, no, I shouldn't be here. Yeah, no shit. Oh, we have to talk. Are you alright? I'm fine. Thank you. I just needed to warn you. They're after me? They know I did it? I was down in Flea Bottom last night when I overheard a couple of Lannister guards talking about. Shh. Talking about what? Once again, that doesn't look suspicious at all. I already know he's missing. Staring Can't at him. Dead. They're questioning people, searching for his body. Please tell me you took care of it. Of course. I told where you Where did I he? Would. Where could he put a? He no probably put it in the freaking flowers. It's freaking gardens here. What? what I did? What is it? If we're gonna survive uh, this, there can't be any details we've overlooked. I I still have his knife. Oh, oh no. Yeah, I should probably get rid of that. Just keep it hidden and clean the blood off it. I'm sorry. Just. Just Still not Stay entirely inside. sure this How? guy's on my side. Do you forget who I serve? I would not be entirely surprised if you get in any more trouble. If he abandoned me when he got a second. Back. We're in this together now. Why are you helping me? Because he's what not who mean? he seems. I'm a friend, Lady Mira. My name's Tom. We help each other. Or it's both our heads. What were you even doing there that night? I once told you. There are people who'd be willing to help you. People who want you alive. I'm here to make sure that happens. You see, he already has a higher you master. Someone. Mira. My lady. That's my husband, huh? Really? A tryst in the bushes with that cold boy. Yeah, it's not like he's eight years old or anything. Not to say it's wrong. But with all the lords and knights in King's Landing, can we just keep it between us? She's gonna blabber of course. for sure. That's what friends Good do. Good, you know what? Cool boy's gonna get caught. Come on. Me, uh, this girl's Marjorie gonna be like, us at the throne room. Oh, well, I recognize that boy, and she's gonna you tell someone about it, and word's gonna get around. On the way. Well, uh, we're first doomed. Of all, his this name girl's is gonna talk. And he has this really funny accent. He told me the cleverest story about this festival they have. Really now? That was a really quick story then. I was only there and for like I've given two minutes. Musicians a list of songs to play for Joffrey at the feast. <laughs> Joffrey. I assume you have no problems with the reigns of Castamere. That's not a depressing song at all. I trust you've chosen all the standards, but just to be sure, I'll draw up a list of wedding ballads we favor in Highgard. <coughs> Your Grace, my lady. Which uh. reminds me, Joffrey will require his king's guard close at hand during the feast. I'm afraid we'll have no room for your handmaidens. Oh no! <gasps> but we what was that? Do you object? Yeah. Is that what I heard? I, uh, if you're going your to grace, speak out of turn, girl, I... you should finish what you start. We do as you command, Your Grace. There and we we'll go. spend the feast wherever it pleases you. You'll spend it mopping the stables, if I please. What I a asked dingus. your handmaiden here at the Iron Throne, whom she would serve if forced to choose between yourself and the king. She was deferential to the crown then, as she is now. But words are wind. Very true. Words are weak. In any case, it's kind of cool. Settled. Think about it, actually. The king's guard will stay with Joffrey. Your handmaidens will sit elsewhere. I mean, it does make sense. 
We all are just handmaidens after all. Of course, Your Grace. Anything for my beloved Joffrey. Lady Marjorie, we may not see eye to eye on everything, but I hope you will at least agree with me that our handmaidens should know their place. And that but place is not with my brother, Tyrion. <gasps> no. Well, eh, whatever. She's only the queen. What did she mean by that? You and Tyrion? What you do reflects on me. If something's <clears throat> going on, I need to know yeah, about I, I'll it. I'll tell her. Tyrion, he offered to help my family. He did? Then surely he expects something in return. Tyrion's Sarah, a nice guy. what do you know of this? <laughs> Tyrion approached us, my lady. It was his idea, not Mira's. I don't care what your intentions were, Mira. You went to a Lannister behind my well, back. How's that behind your back? Come I on. I only ever tried to help you. Yeah? And you're Why not helping are me. You making trouble for me. I'm not, asshole. My family needs me. We're losing everything. I have to do whatever I can to help them. I'm not blind to your pain, Mira. But you're the for my family. Are the only ones in the world. Right now, I need you both to be my handmaidens, and that's all I need you to be. Family over queens. <laughs> Let there be no mistake. If I hear of you speaking so much as a word to Tyrion Lannister again, you can go home to your family. Why do you not like Tyrion Lannister? You'd have, you'd have done the same. I'm sorry, my lady. I made a mistake. It won't happen again. Please don't send me home. This can't happen again. Oh man, this is gonna suck when Tyrion comes to me. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Good lord. Good lord. I'm gonna have to talk to him again. We have to do it in secret. Um, Queen, Miss Queenie over there is gonna find out. What is with all the fights? Oh, I see, I was dreaming. It was only just a dream. Uh oh. Oh. Roderick, no. It's the White Hills. They're seven White Hills. That's what they're called. Why are they They've beating people the up? You can't let this go on. They want to see us cower. Don't worry, Sal. I'll deal with them. Hurry. I'll check on Mother. Mother. Oh boy, what am I gonna do? Ah, uh, I'm gonna go out there, I'm gonna yell at them, and then they're gonna trip me. It's gonna be terrible, terrible times. Uh oh, they're gonna light fires. What is this? It's a parade of dead men if I have my way. <laughs> oh, he's awesome. What a dink! Why? What is the point? Bro. Oh. To scare us, I guess. What is the meaning of this? I demand to know. <laughs> yeah, this is really words. funny. For a cripple who can't carry <gasps> oh, sword. It's the guy. I don't know who that is. Probably the all of you. Griff. Show your respect Griff. to Griff Whitehill, fourth-born son of Lord Lud Whitehill and commander of this garrison. Oh, you're dead. You are gonna die. Cocky Roderick, we used to call you. Swinging your prick round, lording it over my family. Now look at you, hey, Roderick the Ruined. Now, well, temporary you, name, but the name fits, don't it? <laughs> Pathetic. Get your men out of my sight. This is absurd. That sounds like the old Roderick. In his chest, every chance he got. <sighs> I don't think he gets it. Here you go, oh, Lord. I don't think he does. Your brother is a punch in the arm. You bite your tongue. I am in charge now. And the first thing you need to know is that if I am not happy, no one is happy. So my men are taking over your great hall. That's where we'll quarter from now on. Oh God! What? You can't. You'll have to go through me. I won't have my men sleeping out in your barn in shit and filth. Maybe that's how foresters live, but not. <sighs> I don't care if you're happy or not. You'll quarter where I tell you. I wasn't fucking asking, Roderick. And what's more, you will treat my men right. 
I've heard what you've done. His Pushing uncle. Wine on them, turning them into drunkards. That ends now. I'm not here to keep them in line. I'm here to keep you in line. You think you're being clever? Yep. If your men don't <laughs> like it here, you can march them back to High Point. Watch yourself, Roderick. This is against the King's law. You've no right to make such demands. I have every right. You do not. We're here under the orders of Bruce Burton, <coughs> Warden of the North. So I will be in your halls. I will be in your courtyard. I will sit on your fucking council and be in your bedchambers if I bloody well please. You can't do this, little bastard. You can't just do we'll whatever. We'll do what we were sent here to do. No, I'll have to stand my ground. I have this to stand my, my ground. And you will do as I say. Why should I listen to some cripple with half a face? Now, me and my men will take our place in your hall. Unless you think you and your army can still learn. We need freaking god dang. Asher, get over here now! You know better than that. You know where we'll be. This is outrageous. Roderick! You can't go in there. We can and we will. Good Unless God. you want this all to end right now. Eh? Hey, he's Canadian! <laughs> I'm the only lord here. Come on. Oh man. What do we do? This sucks. When are we gonna sleep? Oh yeah, I got my heart beating. Griff White, that snot nosed fourth ball. Parading in here like a conquering fucking hero. It was bad enough when it was just the soldiers. We can't live with them under our roof, soiling our house. I know I'm sure they're wrecking everything there. But this occupation will break our people if it drags on. That's clearly what he wants. We can't <sighs> let that scut rule this house. Like he's the cock and we're in his Well, what do we do? I need I'm suggestions here. I've seen the soldiers in our holes. Whitehill's runt is at the front of the pack. So don't act as if I don't know how bad it is. Of course not, my lord. Uh, what do I do? But Griff Whitehill isn't the beginning of our troubles. Or the end of them. We need uh. to look at all the pieces. Whitehill men... Not just in our house. They've raided our lands. Okay, stand now. Burnt farms and cut down our trees. All the way from here to High Point. How do we kill a snake then? By smashing its head. Griff is in the head. It's his father. Perhaps. But Griff is here. We have access to him. And they have Ryan. <sighs> hostage, 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 hostage. That's supposed to be Ryan. He carved these soldiers himself. Oh, I see. I don't care what Gwyn Whitehill may have told you at the funeral. Who knows what horrors they're putting him through? Held prisoner at High Point. No, I. Gwyn's probably being truthful. She could be a pawn, but I, I believe her. But we have to do something. Yeah. My lord, at least give us a target to aim for. I don't know what to say. No one will back us up here. Save Ryan. Spell. Uh, do you want to expel Griff? Ryan will die. If we go to pick, if we save Ryan, we'll leave Griff here. Family should come first, but I think we'll get Griff out of here and then worry about Ryan later.